Hello, hello. All right, I think uh, I think we should get started here pretty soon. Uh, hello to uh, to everybody here. Welcome. How is your Sunday morning so far? Uh, mine's been pretty okay. Uh, I just had some pancakes. Uh, I uh, I got I got showered. And I'm I'm in the mood to play a little bit more Sonic Adventure 2. Uh, this time we're gonna be playing the Dark Side Story, which has our favorite Edgy Boy. Uh, sh <laughs> that's right, uh, Doctor Eggman himself. Uh, <laughs> anyways, uh, I guess uh, before we get all the way into it, uh, we should do a little bit of housekeeping. Uh, hello. Uh, I am Piper. Pronouns are she, her. You can learn more about me in the, uh, the info panels, um, in the about section. Uh, before joining chat, I would ask that you, uh, all read the rules. Uh, pretty standard stuff, I think. Uh, no hate speech. Just, just be cool and chill to people. Uh, no backseating, no spoilers. Uh, you know, I, I... It's been a bit since I played Sonic Adventure 2. I do know what the story is, and but some people may not. Uh, I also have beaten this game several times before, so I know what I'm doing. But even if I don't know, uh, it's okay. I'm. It's all about relearning the game. It's all about getting getting used to doing it all over again. So if I make mistakes, uh, oopsie, but it's fine. We all make mistakes. Uh, I don't think I'll get stuck, but if I do, I will ask the chat to help me in very specific times, like when I say, hey chat, can you help me? That's when you can backseat. Um, also, uh, <laughs> donations. Donations are always appreciated. Uh, you know, I... Will also appreciate uh, subscriptions and possibly even bits when I get the when I get the whole that whole thing set up. Uh, but also the most the easiest, fastest, and most direct way to support me financially would be to go to either the donate panel that is underneath this video, or to go uh, type into the chat uh, exclamation point tip or exclamation point donate, and that will get you a link to my Streamlabs tip page where you can donate some money to me and you know it would be very very appreciated uh, but certainly not uh, required in any way uh, I will shout you out and get uh, read out your message if you decide to if you end up donating uh, every little bit counts um, so yeah I guess we'll bring up that goal now Yeah, uh, so, there's a, there's our donation goal for, I guess, this week. Uh, you know, again, any, anything and everything is appreciated. Uh, don't feel like you have to, only, only donate if you feel like this is a, this is a stream, this is content worth supporting. Uh, and, and you know, I want to keep working hard to make sure it is. Uh, with all of that said... I think we can, uh, start up the game now. Uh, by all means, let me know if, uh, if something is, you know, just, uh, if all the, uh, the audio levels are okay. You know, I would, I'd very much like to have that, uh, figured out. Ugh, games are so loud though. Ah. Hold on a second. I need to I need to adjust things on my end so that it's not blowing my ears out. How's this? Okay. Alright, that's much better.
Oh, wow. Wow. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so the SA2 PC port is not great. Uh, wow. The, uh... Oh, okay. Hmm. This is strange. I'm not hearing any, uh, any sound effects. This is weird. Uh, hey, could you hear the sound effects? Or is it just me on my end? Anyways. Stage select. Uh, technically, I know we said we were going to do, uh, Dark Side Story, but there is one thing I ended up forgetting last time. And that is getting my hands on... Okay, yeah, yeah, I don't... Mm. Okay, I did something bad here. Alright, give me just one second. Um... Stage select. I'm gonna, I'm gonna restart this game. Hopefully, uh, the sound will work properly with me. One second, one second, hold on. Okay. Let's try... that one again. Okay, there it is. We're good now. Okay, so I know I said we would be doing Dark Side Story first, but there is one thing I forgot, which will be basically required for us to do anything to succeed in the final story, which is to actually get the Aqua Necklace. For Knuckles. I I just had had gotten into such a good groove of finding the emerald pieces that I completely forgot about actually getting the aqua necklace, which is very much required for him. I mean I'm sure you can do the final stage without the aqua necklace, but I, I imagine it's very, very hard. So, I don't want to really challenge myself on that right, right this second. Um, trying to remember exactly where I go to get it. Um, is it this way? No. So I may have forgotten ex entirely where, uh, the Aqua Necklace actually even is. Hmm. If only I had a radar to find the Aqua Necklace, that would make things a lot easier for me. Nope. Okay. Just need to fiddle around with the the water levels a little bit. Yes, thank you, Oma Chow. I have it. Hmm. I wonder if this is it. not showing up? Gameplay's not on screen? Okay, um, let me fix that. Pop. Okay, how's this? Oh no! Okay, I made a mistake. How's this? Can you see the game now? Yep. Alright, sorry about that. Uh, <laughs> You know, just need to... Just needed to make sure. Um... South Pole 89, thank you for the follow! I really appreciate it. Okay. 
Now to find out where this... <sighs> time to remember where to find this hecking aqua necklace. Uh... Do I need it to be at level 2? I think so. Hmm. Oh, yeah. I, hmm, at least I think this, no. I know this is a place I can go. I don't know if this is the place to go, though. Ah! Oh, South Pole 89, thank you for the host! Ah, you're so nice. Always, always good to have, uh... Have more, more eyes on me, I guess. Uh... Really, I really appreciate it. Ugh. Dang it. No, you know, maybe I should have actually looked up where the, uh to get the aqua necklace, because I keep forgetting exactly where it is. It's just... Mm. Okay, South Pole, uh... Do you... I actually am going to ask you for a little bit of help here, if you happen to know. Uh... What's the... What's the process I need to go through to actually get the aqua necklace? Because, um... I've forgotten where to go to get it. Um, or I guess tell me, like, first of all, like, just what water level I should have this at. I don't want to spend too much time looking for the aqua necklace. Uh, I don't think there is a map, is the thing. Oh, come on. Alright, actually I think I know where it is now. I saw that and now I remember. It's level three. Yeah, cause now now I remember that's the uh, that's the that's the hole that I want to go down. Break that. Also annoying that you have to raise the water level up to level one just to be able to come up here again. Yep, level three. Uh... Now where was that thing? There it is, right here. Ah! No. Yep. There we go. Alright. Now I know where to go. Keep on swimming. How are you? How are you liking these uh these knuckle these knuckles rap jams? No! Get up! Get up! Get up! Get up! Air necklace. Okay, yeah, we did it. Um. Hmm. Do I need to beat the level to actually? get the thing let's uh let's let's do it just to be safe i picked a 100 ring so it's not going to be it take too much effort 
Especially not when we're around here. Also, did I see another... <sighs> yeah. Which one's your favorite? I'm... I'm... Ugh. Camera. Uh... <laughs> I'm I'm partial to Pumpkin Hill myself, but you know this one's this one's surprisingly like really chill and really good too. All right, we only need ten more rings. It's fine. It's fine. It's okay. I did it. I did it. Well, that's gonna help, I guess. Uh... Okay. Maybe I should actually look for a place where there are rings. There's also that fire skull right there, which I don't know if it actually... ...breathes fire in this particular stage. Rings be here. Nope. How about here? Come on. Just give me give me ten rings. Knuckles. Is that a JoJo reference? Sorry, he just said ora 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 ora, and I thought, hmm, maybe. Come on. Ah. I mean, I'm already gonna fail this mission, anyways. Or, like, it'll be, like, it'll be a hard E rank. Um, I'm gonna say I don't, hmm, I'm, I'm paranoid. I'm going to find those ten rings. I get, provided I actually can get the water level. Uh. <laughs> Okay. There's some rings here. Ah, get. Thank you. Okay, it's not a lot. Ah. I just want ten more rings. Is that so much to ask? I swear this ah You know what? I'll find 10 rings down here for sure. I know there are rings over here. Oh, right above me. There we go. Finally. Okay. I have to try. Yeah. Ugh. I mean, yeah, the, the camera movement is uh, is definitely something for sure. Um, you know, this was this was a game made with uh, with only on a console with where the controller only had one analog stick. So you had to try your hardest. Anyways, now we got all that taken care of. We can move on to the meat of this uh, of this stream, the dark story. Here we go. Prison Island. Alert. 
Standard battle procedures initiated. Locate and stop the intruder from entering the secure area. This is not a drill. Repeat, this is not a drill. That was all too easy. Let's take a look at what my grandfather was working on. A top secret military weapon. The military shut down the research because they feared it. Ah. Intruder alert. Assume level one defense formation. Because as we all know, the only true way to start a to start a Sonic game is with a mech shooting section. True story, I actually the first time I played this game, I actually started with um I actually started with Dark Side Story. So the first So the first, uh, I ever heard, uh, first experience with Sonic Adventure 2 was this. And yeah, he has a grandfather. Um, one could argue the game kind of centers around him. But, uh, I won't give away too much. There's many revelations to be had in this story. Which is why it's actually recommended to play Dark Side Story second. Also, how are the levels? Can you hear me okay? Can you hear the game okay? Dang it. Oh, that's right. Ah, I'll be back later, I guess. Alright, that's good. <laughs> Just a very, uh... A very matter-of-fact statement of, uh... This guy's getting through our, our things. Get him. Now, could sound a little bit more concerned. Oh well. All right, we're making we're making good time and good uh, good combos, I'd say. Okay, now you're now you're getting upset. Now you're putting in the the emotion, the effort. I lost my barrier. Uh oh. I have to be very careful. Anyways. Oh right, I have to trigger this first. Oh no, how am I gonna get through all those doors? Well, if I just shoot a button, it'll shoot a rocket for me. And there we go. 20,000 on the dot? Heck yes! <laughs> Alright. <sighs> yeah, I know. Uh, I think that's my first A rank of this playthrough, honestly. I may have to go back and do... I would like to get all the emblems in this game. 
So. So this is the military's top secret weapon. It's a lot smaller. Hopefully, I can get all the the air ranks in future streams. Enter user data. Enter password. This is how you know this game. Password is Maria. Maria. Now all I have to do is to place the Chaos Emerald into this console. God, there really is not much, not much else like this, uh, in terms of the Sonic franchise. It's just so spooky and ominous and cool. Here he comes! Our favorite edgelord! There he is! Also, hi, Cowboy Knuckles. This is Scorpion Trips Hotshot. Enemy movement has been detected. En route to intercept and destroy. Copy that. All right, here we go. Okay, bad example. Ah! Ah, come on. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I guess you didn't want to get hit. That's fine. It's fine. It's fine. said fuck the military industrial complex robot was spectacular so shadow you are the military's top secret weapon but what did you mean when you said you will grant me a wish bring more chaos emeralds <laughs> shadow wait i'll be waiting for you in the central control room on the space colony arc arc <laughs> He's so he's so flabbergasted that he tell uh, to be told to go to a place. Ah, here we are. Just let it go. You just don't know when to give up, do you? What are you talking about? That emerald's mine. You got that? The master emerald contains special powers that neutralize the energy of the chaos emerald. That makes it very powerful. What, what the? the? Look who's calling who at me. I came here following the signal from the Emerald. If I'm not mistaken, this is the Master Emerald, is it not? Dr. Eggman. So that's Dr. Eggman. Well, I guess I can use it for something. <laughs> so he's explicitly told to get more Chaos Emeralds? And then his next course of action is to steal the Master Emerald, knowing full well it's not the same thing. Now, would that be Barbara Gordon, or Cassandra Kane or... Nah. Not that kind of Batgirl. I do really like Rouge's themes in this game, though. Got a classical, uh, spy vibe to them. 
also saving this turtle is uh, is a necessity. In fact, dare I say, I think it is our first course of action. It sure is. He really does need a break. Uh, luckily, after this game, he kind of stops being the guardian of the Master Emeralds, like, forever. They just kind of forget about that part. So I guess that's kind of a break. Okay, hmm. Oh, it's just right here. Alright. Well, the next one is, uh, not here. Also, I mentioned this before, uh, really, really would have wished that, um, that the, uh, the Emerald Radar in SA2 worked like the one in SA1, where it would just pick up the signals from any of the Emeralds and tell you where they are. Instead of ha if being, like, required to find them in an order. That's kind of annoying. Um... Nah, I'm not gonna chance it. But, we are actually making pretty good time on this one. Although it is clearly not over here. And I don't think it's even over on this side either. Oh, it is. Oh, it's right there. Come on, let me get it! There we go. But was that enough for an A rank? 17,000. How was that? Perfect? Like me? Wow, I'm... I'm... I'm doing pretty well, all things considered. I was getting mostly B's and C's last time. Consider myself lucky, I guess. Desert area. Those idiots will never find my hidden base inside this <laughs> You know, the one that has, uh... He says... Nobody will ever find his base, even though it is clearly surrounded by, uh, by military vehicles and robots and everything. So it seems to me like they have very much found it. Oh, right. I, I can't hover yet. I will be getting that ability very soon. For right now, I need to be careful. Uh... Also, hmm. I also have not yet gotten a Chow key. Or a Chow Garden key. Can I? Okay. Alright, it's fine. It's fine. We did it. We're here. Oh, whoa. Almost got hit by that guy. There we go. Ah, I hate this. Okay. See, we're doing it, we're doing it. Ah! Whoa, 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 whoa. No! No, 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 no! Dang it. Ah, uh, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's not like we were five rings away from another one-up. Ah. Uh, it's alright. I have 18 lives. I'm, I'm doing pretty good. And I can grind for lives later. Lives and rings. You better believe one of these days, I, we're just gonna do a full Chow Garden 
stream. Just nothing but Chow Garden. Because that's where the real adventure is at. In fact, let's get ourselves a, a little taste of the Chow Garden this stream anyways. I have these drives I've been collecting. I've gotten some of these, uh... Some of these animal critters. I don't know why there's just this huge section of pots to destroy, but I would like doing it. You know. Brings out the inner... the inner Zelda... player in me. Gotta destroy all the pottery! It's just compulsive at this point. the hover thing? I could have sworn I got it way sooner than this. Guess not. Maybe it's... maybe it's in the next level. Ah. Uh. No one will ever find this base. This... <laughs> not amidst these elaborate... These super elaborate turning stone... Everythings, and these giant statues that pretty sure were not... You know... Weren't there initially. Also, hmm... Oh, that would be the reason why. Uh, I just want the hover boot, the hover power up thing already. This is so annoying to have just a lame limp jump. Come on. Okay, I feel like I missed it. It's fine. I'm already here. If I missed it, I can just go back to stage select. That was too close. Ow! Ow! I didn't know I did that bad. Okay. Well, here we are at Chow World. The only time you get to see Eggman on foot in this game, or control him anyways. And boy, he... he looks... look at him. Look at... <laughs> look at his little legs as he... as he turns... as he strafes, basically. Whoop, 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 whoop. Anyways, let's go to the Chow Garden. <laughs> Had enough, uh... Did enough, uh, messing around for me personally. Alright. Get the swim. You. Swim better. Or, I guess, run. Never mind. Where's the other one? There you are. Fly better, please. Here's your- your fly. 
Yay! Uh... Get better at running. Now, who needs power? Who is baby that needs power? Um... Run free. Fly free. I really should give them names. Um... Hmm. You know what, let's also give you th this bird. Hooray, you are now part bird. I'm trying to think which one I want to be... Hero, and which one I want to be Dart. I think I'll have this one be. Yosh. I forget exactly where I go to name them. Is it here? No, this is the- this is purely a Chow departure machine. I don't want to get rid of the Chow. Hmm. Can I... Hmm. Well, I guess I can... I can pop in here and see what happens? Okay, it is purely for getting rid of Chow. Okay. Boop! Okay. Am I even allowed to go to the school if I have been doing the story mode? Oh! Uh, nope. Nope. I have to go back to the story. That's fine. With the chaos emerald in the space colony arc. Hmm. I've got to find out just what's going on up there. Uh We interrupt this broadcast for an important news flash. Scratch my butt. At the Federal Reserve Bank today. Mysteriously, the only thing the that was stolen was the Chaos Emerald. Ah, uh, yeah. According to eyewitnesses at the scene, the Sonic Adventure 2 has, has a, what we call, Sonic the uh, not great sound mixing. The scene, destroying the it's pretty bad. In his path. Stay tuned for Sounds more details. More like the work of Shadow. I will say that this music is peak late 90s, early 2000s. Shadow, I beg of you, please Maria. do it for me. For all the people on that planet. Sayonara. Shadow the Hedgehog. I still remember what I promised, promised you. For the people of this planet, I promise you. Revenge. Hey, can you believe that, uh, there are only... There are only four shadow stages in the entire game? I know, kinda sucks. I really wish there were more shadow stages. Although I guess they make up for it by having a lot of Sonic stages, but... It's not the same. It's not the same as having this guy's weird hover skate things. Get on the thing. Hey listen, sometimes cheesy soundtracks are good soundtracks. You never know. Also, Shadow doesn't get the Bounce Bracelet, so, uh, it's already inferior to Sonic. Hey, 
go. Cowboy Knuckles, thank you for the follow. I super appreciate it. Oh, come on. Hold on a second. Two disc special edition. Chow in space. Two. You know, I think I prefer ultimately prefer the original Chow in Space. Uh, I just feel like it had a lot more heart to it. Chow in Space 2 is a little bit too... I don't know. It, it, it tries to play things too safe. You know? I also didn't really appreciate uh, the, uh, the revelation that uh, that uh, Chowminster was uh was actually uh was actually Baby Bub's uh father. I, I felt like they had a fantastic uh mentor student relationship without needing to have a, a familial bond. Cause, you know, the the themes of the original Chow in Space really really made it seem like like legacy was just sort of a a fake thing that didn't really need to be, uh... to be relied upon, that greatness could come from anywhere. And then here comes Chow in Space 2 being like, ah, oh, no, I, actually it's because you're related to this super awesome, cool Chow. And, you know, I, I feel like... I don't know. I do... I do like the Dark Chow subplot really and truly, but... I don't know. I'm still waiting for, uh, for Chow in Space 3 to really, um... To, to finally come out, because it's, I, I, I'm still hopeful that maybe they'll find a way to make that... make those retcons, uh, work in the grander scheme of things. Um, and I really hope they don't just reboot it. That's true, Chow in Space 2 did have some great fight scenes. Like, especially the Chow Walker duel, that was, ah. It was incredible. Oh well. Here we go. Already, I'm going to miss, uh, not playing as Shadow for a while. <laughs> they sure did. Um, what? and I think that that might have been why they may have, uh, chickened out of doing some of the more, uh, it all starts with this. the more, uh, daring the themes of the original. The I, I think they wanted to appeal to a greater audience, and I know, I know, there were some fans who were really clinging to that, uh, Chow Monster is, uh, Bub Chow's father theory, and I, I know they were trying to placate those fans, but I, mm, I don't know. I just I just think it was ultimately better that uh, that that Bub Chow was a nobody, a nobody that could achieve greatness all on his own. Oh boy! Now we get to do more of this. This is Rouge. I've located Eggman's base and will proceed to enter it now. <sighs> I hate to say it. I guess I'm going to have to find that key first. Ah! Uh... Oh yeah, there's this thing which I have to avoid at all costs. Ah! Uh... Okay. Uh, I already hate Death Chamber. 
And, like, this is basically just Death Chamber again. Hold on. Are the, uh, upgrades here? Nope. I know... <sighs> okay, I didn't mean to get the hint, but thank you, I guess. Nope. Oh, there it is. It's right over there. Right on pick nails. Now we can dig, finally. Um. Oh, yeah, mad space is really bad. Um. Which was Rouge's equivalent of that, though? I- here's the thing. I don't like it because it's so big, but I also really like the, uh, the gimmick of it a lot, too. Like, especially with the, uh, the reverse detector readings, I think was a really neat, uh, way to make things more difficult in the final level. But also, um... Huh. But also, just, it's so big. Ah! This is the egg fish it's gotta be close. Oh, there it is. It's just right there. Ah, took me way longer than I needed to. Could you please... For some reason, it destroys the robot, but not the cage. You know, I'm not too upset by that. Also, not sure why Eggman decided to, uh... Oh! Oh, yeah, yeah, that's right. Rouge's is mad space. Uh... Hmm, I'll have to- I'll have to play through mad space again, see if I- I... See if I hate it as much. Because, uh, Meteor Herd is, um... Ha. Ah. That's right, it is Meteor Herd. Um... I don't love Meteor Herd either. It's the thing. It's a little bit sad that the, uh, the Knuckles stages stop being good, like, basically right after Pumpkin Hill. Uh... Because Aquatic Mine is annoying, and Meteor Herd is just so, so big. Um, I do remember really liking Security Hall, though. If nothing else, I really like the music in Security Hall. But we'll get there in a second, won't we? Um, provided I can find these keys. Jeez, that... that scarab robot is everywhere! Uh, I get it, they wanted to make it something like a stealth level, but jeez. Can I move now? Nope. Not. Okay, so it's still out here. Oh? Where is it? Could you? Hmm. Ah! Is it up here?
Dang it. <sighs> Where could this be? I feel like I'm right on top of it. Oh. Ah, okay. I've been doing not great this whole stage. Oh, come on! Ah! Also, Eggman decided to bring back the E-102 Gamma model for some reason. You know... I, I thought he would have been done with it after SA1, but uh, I guess not. Nope. Uh. Yes, yes. I know I'm not gonna get a good ranking here. I took way too long. See, I was in this room already earlier. This is what I mean. I was in this room getting another key. And they were still- they- this radar didn't tell me that this was in here. It was only focused on the first one and not the third. So, like, I could have found this much earlier just because I was in proximity to it already. But the radar only ever expects you to find things in a specific order. It's so frustrating, especially considering Sonic Adventure 1 did let you find the emerald pieces in every order, in any order you wanted. And this one's so finicky. It's like, no, it has to be the one that you have to find first or second. Ugh. Wasn't that space colony shut down over 50 years ago? What's he doing up there anyway? Doesn't matter. It's my mission to find out what he's up to. You you really had to do that pose before warping? I mean, I don't hate the pose. It's cute, but I love this level so much. I love how f how spooky and moody it is. Ah, it just sets such a cool atmosphere. And also the gimmick of having to blow things up to light light your way is also really cool. Ah, man. See, it's funny. I don't love the Tails levels very much, but the Eggman levels are almost all fantastic. I mean, hidden base was whatever, but I like this. Hover thing is in this level, maybe? I sure hope so. Yeah, because, uh, whew, I can already tell some of these jumps are going to be frustrating. Here you are. Jet engine! Now we can fly. Uh, pff, okay, weird. Took you a bit to actually pop the bu balloon, but sure. Alright. Oh, 
Ah! I didn't even see you there! My mech body was too big. Close, huh? Okay. Oh, so many. <laughs> no, get him. Yeah. Okay. Always get the gold beetle worth so many points. Heck yeah. Ah, I'm missing so many of these. I don't even know if that's considered good enough. We'll find out, I guess. Lock onto the dynamite, please. camera. You can be like that, I guess. Ah! Ah! Big one. How do we do? I think probably not great. I remember... Oh! Phew! I, I thought I, I screwed that up, but I guess not. <sighs> I've been waiting for you, Doctor. Now, I will show the glorious achievement of what the world's leading scientist, Professor Gerald, has created. The Ark was the first space colony created by mankind. Not many people know that the Ark contained a top secret research facility where weapons of mass destruction were being created. Just look at this place, this it's so cool. Weapon, a weapon capable of destroying an entire planet, codenamed the Eclipse Cannon. It's a legally distinct Death Star, the best kind of distinct. It's been deactivated for some time now. <laughs> reactivate it. Large amounts of energy are necessary. Oh, so that's why we needed the Chaos Emerald. Exactly. To reactivate the machine, we need the seven Chaos Emeralds. I know, I love him in this game. Once you have that, then you have the ultimate power of destruction. He becomes really brooding in, like, later games. And to that, see him... The world could be yours. To see him just so, like, theatrical with his villainy here is, like, really refreshing. Do you really think it will be that easy? 
mean, I know it's because he's not a villain in later games, but still. I've got a great idea. How about making a deal? A deal? De when you grab that huge emerald, you said something about a reaction. A reaction that it may have with the Master Emerald. Now, if you could just let me borrow that radar, I may be able to help you. What do you think? If I do... What's in it for me? I have an idea where the other Chaos Emeralds may be. It may not look like it, but do you know that I am a treasure hunter that specializes in all kinds of jewels? <laughs> ah. Very well. Okay then, it's a deal. I don't think we've been introduced. I'm Rouge the Bat, but you can call me Rouge. to come back isn't my idea of a vacation. How can you be sure your intelligence reports are correct? Why would the Chaos Emerald be here on the island? Are you absolutely sure? Well, believe what you want to believe. <laughs> very well, very well. Let's discuss how we are going to do this. I will go in first and distract the military troops, allowing you to sneak in the base without being detected. Then, Shadow will enter the armory, where he will set the timer on these dynamite packs. Once that is in place, we will blow up the whole island and get away before anyone has a chance to know what hit them. Meanwhile, you'll have to sneak into the cargo area and grab the chaos emerald. That's a challenge for such a worthy treasure hunter as yourself, isn't it, that girl? Yeah. We only have 30 minutes to pull this mission off, and we only get one try, so don't fail me. Yeah, the characterization in this game really is, like, top-notch. I miss how... I miss the writing style of these older games. They're... incredible. Power. This is also just a really good level to just rack up as many bonus points as you can. Also, don't... Alright, here we go. Large cannon! We can now break the metal containers! Yay! Finally! Ah! I missed my chance to get big bonus points on you. Oh well. There will be other opportunities. Also, uh, kind of fucked up that the military just happens to have three Chaos Emeralds lying around. Real, uh, real dark stuff. Now, I'm not saying I want to watch Sonic X, because I don't remember it being great, but I do wonder if they actually go into further detail about what the, uh... what the military is doing with, like, three other Chaos Emeralds. You know. Dang it! Also, I shot the chow- the Omo Chow. Also, I am just the slightest bit curious about, uh, the plot of Season 3 of that show, since it sounds like it's better than literally anything else that ever was in that show. Um... Even if it was, like, peak... If it was, like, peak, uh you know, mid-2000s Sonic writing, where it's, um... 
I don't know. I, I here's the thing. I would prefer mid two thousands Sonic the Hedgehog writing over the uh, the writing we've had in Sonic games for like the last decade, where it's just a little bit too saccharine and too um, like very clearly. The, the writers have said that, like, before taking on the job of writing Sonic games, they basically knew nothing about Sonic the Hedgehog. And so I think that that ends up coloring a lot of how they wrote that series. And, you know... Regardless of whether or not the games were any good, it, I don't know, it felt like they, like there could have been, the writing style in, uh, in game, dang it, the writing style in, like, oh, it sends me all the way back here, come on, ah, I need to focus. But, like, the writing style in games post-colors... I mean, I'll, I'll say this. I have yet to play Lost World or Forces, which I hear are, like, the worst in terms of its writing style. But I could already feel that there was a, there was a downgrade in writing. Uh... Starting with colors. Yeah, a lot of people don't like the, uh... A lot of people back in the day didn't like the fact that, like, oh, you had to play as all of Sonic's friends, but you know what? At least it kept the gameplay, like... Gave it a little bit more variety. And I'm not saying that there isn't, like variety in, like, modern versus classic Sonic versus, I guess, um, I guess the, uh, the avatar, the, the player character, uh, the OC. I don't know. I, I probably will end up playing Lost World and Forces eventually, just so that I have a clearer picture of what is going on in those games. But, I don't know. I already knew that uh, Sonic was not going to be what I wanted it to be uh, for a while. And I was really disappointed that, uh... Because, like, Forces, by all accounts, what looked like what I wanted another Sonic game to be, like, in terms of its tone and writing. But then... Then everything I heard about it was like, oh... They, they actually didn't really try that hard. I'll, ah! I promise I'm usually better at this. Well, so much for having a good rank on this level. But I miss uh, multiple playable characters too. Sonic Adventure games are really, really fun. Heck, Sonic Adventure 1 is really fun just because of how many different gameplay styles there are in that game. I'm not going to say all of them were good, Big the Cat, but they were... They were at least something interesting and something new to do. I actually really like the, uh, the Amy and, uh, Gamma stages in SA1. So... You know. It has been three years since Forces, though, so I think... I think... Sega is, like, really... having a big, long think about what, uh... what their future Sonic games are gonna be like. And I really hope that some, like, really meaningful change 
ends up happening with that franchise, because I want it to change, and I want it to improve. I think we're finally getting... making some good headway here. I mean, worst case scenario, uh, Sega just lets m the fans make all their Sonic games forever from now on. Yeah, definitely. And, uh... <laughs> Hey, if you end up getting Sonic Mania Plus, you can also play as Ray the Flying Squirrel and Mighty the Armadillo. Characters that, like, whoever thought they'd even come back in any capacity. <laughs> and now you can play as them? Yep. It's incredible how, uh, how people just do not seem to, uh, seem capable of telling the difference between Shadow and Sonic. Then again, Amy, uh, Amy thinks Silver is Sonic in Sonic 06 at one point, so, I don't know. I love this boss theme so much. Yeah, maybe they died. He dyed his hair and also completely styled it differently. All right. Now, some people complain about Rouge, um... Saying, like, oh, five minutes should be plenty, even though it's like, but then why not take the 15 minutes? Uh, I think it's because, you know, they set the timer for the explosives for 15 minutes, and Rouge is just saying, okay, then that gives me five minutes to actually get the emeralds, and ten minutes to get out. That's how I always read it. Anyways, um, I don't know if I actually- oh wait, that's right, I know what actually is here, in terms of, uh, I'm starting to wonder if I missed the the, uh, the steel boots that I can get as uh, as Rouge, though maybe not. Oh, okay. It's around here someplace. Oh, I just. Oh, it's just right there. What are you doing? Get going. I'm the chaos no. I'm doing my best here, Eggman. Doing my best here, Eggsy. Nope.
Huh. Is it just floating in around here? Nope. Although there's just a skull in here. The military decided to keep a skull in the vault. Okay. Uh, also just hid an emerald in a... in an engine thingy. I said I would... I said I would take five minutes and it should be plenty. I have not yet passed five minutes. I'm good. I'm fine. Uh... There's the emerald upstairs. Let's do another clean sweep. Yeah, I think the emerald might be upstairs. Alright, back to, uh... Ah! Speaking of, uh... Oh, yep, I was right. It's up here somewhere. Uh, somewhere. Oh, okay. Hmm. 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 What the heck? I just had it. Oh man, am I gonna run out of time? I think so. I see it! I see it! I see it! Let me get it! Let me get it! Let me get it! Oh! No, I just got it in the nick of time. I know I didn't get a good rank, but who cares? Fuck you. Oh. I think I... Alright. I mean, hey, that, that works too. Still not an A, but ah, uh, she should have collected that ring. I can't believe I've come this far just to fail. Uh oh. Yeah, now time to just fly right into him. Yeah. Oh, come on! Yay! She ended up beating the guard robot, but she still ends up getting arrested and trapped anyways. Go figure. Treasure Hunter with, a uh, capitalized Treasure and Hunter. Didn't know it was a proper title. Shoot, Troublemaker. Ah! Whoosh. Hunt. 
Now I think in this level we can get, uh... Oh yeah, we get light speed shoes. And, um... Trying to think of where I get the other upgrades. Radical Highway I'll have to go back to when I have light speed dash. Um, because that has the fire ring. Ah! Uh, Shadow. Thank you. Um. Does... I know Shadow gets Ancient Light, I just don't remember where. Ah, dang it. I'm sure it'll be something for a later stream, because it's not like Ancient Light or Fire Ring are really required for Shadow anyways. I don't think any of his stages require you to be able to actually break Iron Crates ever. Ah! Here we go. real, though? Um... When do we get an another Sonic Riders? I would love to have another chance to play around with the, uh... with the Babylon Rogues again. Like, I know we have, uh, Team Sonic Racing now, which is supposed to be this replacement, but it's not the same. It's not the same as Riders, and you know it. <sighs> yeah, the music is so good. like, way too good. Ah. Uh. Ultimate victory. I should- I should actually buy Zero Gravity. I rented it. Wait. Did I rent it? Or did I just- Whatever, the point is I- hey, blue hedgehog again of all places. I found you, Faker. Faker? I think, think you're, you're the, the fake, fake hedgehog, hedgehog around here. here. You're, you're comparing yourself to me? me? Huh. You're, you're not, not even good enough. enough. I'll make you eat those words. words. Great sound mixing. Impeccable. Yeah, uh, the point is I never actually got to own Zero Gravity. But like, everything I saw looked like it was super, super cool, so... I should... Come on. Come on. Thank you. No time to hang out with the likes of you. All I know is I probably wouldn't care much for free riders, because I don't have the room to even use a connect. Whoops. Eggman Bomb Bomb. Why do you have to make 
his uh his explosives s like such a cutesy candy sounding name also impressive that uh this uh that one explosive was enough to destroy an entire island that's impressive His life's work was dedicated to all of those who live down there. He once told that the reason for his existence was making people happy through the power of science. Shadow. Maria, I just don't know anything anymore. I often wonder why I was created, what my purpose is for being here. Maybe if I go down there, I, I will find the answers. Maybe. Cute because he's Japanese. Yeah, I, I, I suppose so. Why so melancholy? And yeah, Free Riders killed the so Riders series, so uh, much in the same way that Black Knight killed the storybook series. But Whoops. To use the chaos control certainly comes in handy. You know, I didn't come to save you. I came back for the Chaos Emeralds. Yeah, yeah, but then again, that's not the whole story, is it? Everything is ready to go! Are you sure? We only have six of the seven Chaos Emeralds, you know? That's more than enough for the demonstration. Now I will, uh... So let's get the show on the road! I will refrain from, uh... <laughs> from making the obvious, uh, Snap Cube jokes. But just know that I'm aware of them. No, Eggman looks pretty cool, but all the other people in this game look kind of, kind of funky. Also, gotta love that apparently either both Eggman or Gerald Robotnik were narcissistic enough to make their uh, Death Star look like their like uh, Eggman's face. Robotnik is great. <laughs> I didn't notice that uh, that little scrolling uh, text on uh, there before. Brr, I'm so mad. Well, that was really impressive. You've managed to create complete havoc on the whole planet. Does this now mean we control the planet and can do as we choose? At this rate, the cannon will take too much time to charge up. If you want to unleash its full potential. You'll need all seven Chaos Emeralds. Where in the world have you been? Something happened? Our threats fell on deaf ears. Look at you, throwing a tantrum like a little kid. How totally embarrassing. Don't forget your end of the bargain, that girl. What about that last Chaos Emerald? We had a deal, right? So where is my Emerald? Here you go. I found this. Why didn't you show me this before? This Station Square saved from a life-threatening missile attack. A city has awarded its famed prize to the boy who saved Station Square. Miles Tails Per Hour was given the Chaos Emerald as a testament of his heroic deed at a ceremony held at City Hall. <laughs> this makes things a whole lot easier. Hurry, go back to Earth and find them fast. I want the Chaos Emerald! Did you get that? Soon enough, Maria. See, it's funny that they they bring up that uh Currently I have not been able oh. to confirm that Shadow is the ultimate life form or not. I will continue my research on Project Shadow and have a follow-up report very shortly. Just a reminder, don't forget about my jewel. Plot twist. Alright, here we go. 
Hey everybody, do you like Team Sonic Racing? Well, this isn't that. Uh, no, we have this instead. Um... It's funny that they bring up the, uh, the missile attack from Sonic Adventure 1, uh, but Eggman seems completely unaware that, you know, he's the one who caused the missile attack. Also that they gave Ma Tails the, uh, the Chaos Emerald that apparently they just got back after, uh, the perfect Chaos fight, which is, uh, interesting. You know. Ah! It's okay, it's okay, it's fine. We're- we're good. <sighs> Ugh. I am not looking forward to getting all A ranks on these stages. Look at this, I'm crashing into so many walls. Get out of my way, car. Well. It's fine. We're... We're making... Ah! Oh my god. Uh... This is, um... This is not what I'd call ideal driving, but also, I never claim to be good at it. We go. Okay, okay, we're we're Oh my goodness. Goodness, goodness, gracious me. See it's okay, I'm allowed to destroy the cars and slam into walls all I want this time. It is not until later stages where that will become a problem. Doing it, we're doing it. Okay, I missed the rings. It's okay. It's fine. We're basically done. Now give me my terrible rank. I know I deserve it. I know I didn't do good. Just give it to me straight, Doc. How bad is it? How bad was I at doing the kart racing? Ugh. Yeah. You know, I figured as much. Minigame Kart Racing 2 Player Versus is now available. Hooray! Oh, guess what? They're in that blue plane. Spotted at 11 o'clock. Copy that. I'm in pursuit. It's Pumpkin Hill! God, I can't believe it. Yeah, I think it's meant to be the, uh, the same... I think it's meant to be the same location and everything. Also, I did miss that, uh, that checkpoint. Uh... 
hopefully I will be able to make it to the next one without too much issue. Do 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 I mean, this track is still good too, but it's no Pumpkin Hill. Yeah, I know I could have probably gotten that gold beetle, but I didn't want to risk it. No! Ah, uh, it's fine. I can work on getting a better rank another time. Oh, come on! See, this is why I don't want to risk it. Just ignore him for now. Oh, come on. Okay. Need to get better. Need to be better. Whew. Okay. Yeah, one day I will have the cool good ranking for this level, but today is not that day. It's so short, though. Didn't try hard enough. I sure didn't. Doctor, they're heading directly toward us. What should we do? Here we go, just skipping ahead straight to this boss fight. <sighs> that was pretty rough. We did it! Let's go, Amy! Yeah! You little thieves! Did you really think eh? you could get out of here on your own? Come and get some, Eggman! <laughs> just leave it to, to me! me. <laughs> You know, I do like Eggman's theme in later games, but none of them are as cool as this. For the arc, a genius at heart, wanting to unlock the mysteries of life, I am the Eggman. Also, probably one of the worst, uh. Yeah. <laughs> That's one of the worst battle cries ever. Ta ya! I love that no Eggman says. Anyways. Now it's time for Eggman's Egg Golem fight. It is not nearly as fun as Sonic's.
It is, in fact, far more tedious. Just, uh, just keep on shooting until the, uh... Ah! Until that thing opens up. And it's done. Alright, now we've got, uh, I believe just three more stages left. Green light for launch. Primary engine ignition on. Beginning lift Let's hope countdown. Mad Space doesn't Ten, take us forever to nine, do, though. Eight, seven, six, five, oh, but you know what four, level might three, take us forever to do? is Cosmic Wall. Shuttle lift off. Uh, Cosmic Wall is so... S sorry, it's so long! I do love the gravity gimmick, but it's... I don't know if it's enough to save it. Hi, Doctor. How's it going? What? What do you mean they escaped? That's okay. I will go after them myself. Can you tell me the password for the space colony control? Apparently the government agents just know this. <laughs> that old doctor is oh. Just too easy. Right, he was talking oh, to... It's she was talking to, to Eggman. Door. Okay. The password is... Maria. Maria, hmm? I've heard that name somewhere before. Oh well. Now rebooting. This is it. Research Project Shadow. The ultimate life form. Let's see now. What in the world is this? This can't be right. Just what is Shadow anyway? Hmm. I guess I'll just have to take the last pieces of the Master Emerald. Alright, here we go. Mad Space. Detector readings are reversed. Be very careful. Well... I will most likely not be using the detectors too much anyways. But I do remember the gravity gimmick being a little bit annoying. But here we go! Also, is this the stage where we get, uh, the thing that allows us to break metal crates? Seems kind of late in the game to get us those, but, you know. Or are those completely optional? Oh, they're right here. <laughs> that makes sense. Alright. Not on this planet either. Oh, I guess it is on this planet? No. I know it wasn't in that, but still. Okay. Oh, I see it. Let me get up. Thank you. All right. Um. Now, okay. We're just back here. Oh, wait, no. This is a different planetoid. That's right. Hmm. Would it be around here at all? No. Oh. Seems like it's around here. Ah! 
ha ha. Perfect. Okay. Okay. Seem to have picked up around here. Maybe I was wrong. Looking like I was wrong. How about this one? Oh, pfft. Okay, I saw it blip green for just a second. <gasps> oh, it's right here? Oh, how devious. Oh, wow. Ho ho ho! Guess I, uh, guess I lucked out on that one. How was that? Woo! Perfect? Like me? Excellent. Excellent. All right. Um... Now here comes another, uh, kick and punch fight. Did you find my emerald? Look at what, your emerald? Talking to you is a waste of time. For some reason, he doesn't have all the... the gear that I got for him in his last playthrough here. Kick. Oh, punch. I have no choice but to fight now. Hey, what were you doing before? I am sure not, I guess? I must protect well... The master now that took, uh, that actually took a little longer than I expected it to. Also, neither my Rouge nor Knuckles fight, I gave them any chance to use their special attack. I feel a little bad. But not too bad. Phew! Phew! Stop fooling around and give me back my emeralds! What are you babbling about? You call yourself a hunter attacking a lady? Shame on you! What kind of lady goes around stealing gems anyway? Those belong to me! sort of cluster them together and now they become this giant thing. I love it. Finally. What? I'm sorry if I hurt you. And then he just manages to stow it away. We should get going. Whoop. But also a cute little smirk. Cause uh people ship him, I guess. In the pyramid. What's Rouge up to anyway? This is strange. It's showing energy readings from two separate Chaos Emeralds. Did they really think they could trick me with that big emerald? Wait, Shadow. I'm the one who should be telling them the end is near, not you. Now is the time to end this long drawn out battle. Place in history as the ultimate. Get and confront the trespassers. Ah, man. I love this 
I love the look of this place so much, and it's so... Ah. God, I love so many of the, the level gimmicks of in Dark Side Story more than the ones in Hero Story. There's just so much cool stuff they throw in for these ones. It's incredible. I think the only issue I have with Cosmic Wall is that it's really, really long. At least I remember it being really, really long. Uh, could you please get up, please? But that's about the only bad thing I can think about it. Uh, or at least the only bad thing that comes to mind. Such a cool Eggman level. Um, I'm gonna be honest, I am getting a little bit, uh, tired. Um... So I don't know if I will be... I mean, I got a, a few other things I need to do today. So I don't know if I will be doing last story today. Um... I mean, it does mean that, uh, if we, if we end up doing... If we end up doing, uh, last story next time, it's probably gonna end up being a bit of a shorter stream. Of course, I can probably come up with, uh, some way to fill out the time. I don't know. Who knows, maybe last story will end up taking a little bit longer than I expected it to. Um... But I don't know. Uh, I- I do- I do plan on finishing Dark Side Story, because there's not that much of it left here. So I might as well finish it. But... I would like to know... Um... Okay. There's definitely something here. Get it? Protection armor. Health gauge increased. Excellent. I knew there was something in this stage. Um, probably the least necessary thing for him to have, but okay. Um, I don't know. What are you all thinking? I do want to keep this to be more of a morning stream and not a whole... long... like, whole day thing. No, just, just... Just because Sonic games are typically, uh, a bit on the shorter side, as com in comparison to, say, Xenoblade Chronicles, which is 80 hours. Plus, it is, uh, it's starting to become... It's- it's already past noon, so... It's not much of a Sonic Sunday morning anymore, it's... Becoming Sonic early afternoon, and, uh... That's not as, uh... That's just... That doesn't roll off the tongue, or... Resonate quite as well to me.
All right. Also, my commentary isn't what it uh, normally is either, so... You know, got other things to do. Not sure why Eggman felt the need to put all these, uh... Or I don't know who put all these, uh, explodable pyramids just around on this, uh, this whole thing. Seems a bit excessive to me. Missed it. Wahoo! Also, I am pretty confident that I have, uh, I have cleared the score requirement for, uh, an A rank this time. Ah! I say as I get hit. But no, I think it's only, like, 60,000, right? I say only, but... It's just because they give me so much to shoot at. Also, now I gotta shoot that this thing behind me! We did it! Alright. Please be an A rank, please. What? Oh man, that's brutal. I gotta be so much faster too. That time bonus was nothing. Oh. Darn, why do they always leave a sweet little innocent girl like me alone? <laughs> well, well, young lady. Is there something I can help you with? Mr. Eggman! If you value your life, you will tell me where Sonic can Let's take it. <laughs> Sorry, I won't do that again. Turned 
thought you could trick me with that fake emblem, didn't you? So, how did you know it wasn't the real one? Tails! <laughs> because you just told me, Fox Boy. Now, for a little space ride. That will clear the colony fair. I'm counting on you, Tails. Oof. Take care of yourself. Farewell, Sonic the Hedgehog. Sonic! Farewell, Sonic. My admirable adversary. No. <laughs> I know it's a... Uh... I know it's sad, but we kind of already know how it turns out. Real Emerald, I will release you both. You have my promise. Sonic. Huh? Sonic asked me for the first time to do something for him. I won't let him down. I won't give up. What have you done to Sonic? I'll never forgive you for Didn't this. Didn't you see? We kind of blew him up. No! Well, we did it. I guess he was just a regular hedgehog after all. Love that JPEG explosion. Legend has it when all seven Chaos Emeralds are collected, the power creates a miracle. I have six of them. They're mine. All mine. I don't think so. Shadow. So that was your plan. Or was it a direct order from the president? Now I know who you are. You're the government spy. Fine, Rouge the, the Bat. Aren't you? Funny, she didn't even bother using an alias. So you did your homework. Is that it? Say that's an invasion of privacy. I could say the same thing about you. <laughs> it looks like things aren't quite going your way. But since my job was done, I thought it was time to take what's mine and get out of this place. You are one pathetic creature. Hmm. Look who's talking. What about you? Here are the results of the research project called the Ultimate Life Form. But if this picture is of the real ultimate life form named Shadow, <gasps> then exactly who or what is standing in front of me? Ooh. The plot thickens. Oh man. Here we go, final chase. And boy is it a is it a doozy of a level. But we'll do it. We'll make it work. Oh. Now this gimmick is uh is something else. This one I don't know if I actually quite like it as much. The whole uh circling around this weird gravity cylinder. It gives me way too much anxiety. In fact, kind of this whole level gives me a lot of anxiety. Gives me that, uh, gives me a not pleasant feeling of, uh, vertigo. Oh. Yeah, just, uh, just a lot of this. 
It's okay. This is uh this is the last uh the last stage of Dark Story. We're we're basically done. It's fine. It's fine. No! My rings. Gimme. Okay. Is this one okay? I guess it's fine. No! Oh, okay. Here we go, circling everything up. Ooh. I know this is not commentary, this is just me making noises, being very, uh, very anxious about this level. But like, god, it's so much. Oh hey! There's an item up here that I can use. Is it the Ancient Light? Oh, it's the Mystic Melody. Well, I'm glad I got it. Saves me time on... You know, that's probably something I could do for... for the rest of the... the last story stream is, uh... get everybody else's, uh... optional items. Yeah, I could probably use it- uh, use, uh, getting all the other items that, uh, I missed. And, um... Then going straight on to last story, so now that I have everyone decked out with all of their, uh, their final gear. No! Okay, there we go. Whew! So much of this. It's... Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, uh. Okay, I did... No! Are we almost done? Please tell me we're almost done. I think we're almost done. I don't think we are almost done is the thing. Uh. I swear, this is ordinarily a level I have a lot of fun with. But it... Well, ordinarily is a, is a strong term. It's still a good level, it's just also really stressful with these, uh, with the way these, uh, gravity cylinders work. Also, I think I may have missed an item doing that, but that's okay. I am, I'm here to, to survive. Oh, there it is. That is the end. See, that wasn't so bad. That wasn't so bad, was it? Alright. Was that a good rank, at least? Heck yes! Alright. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Alright.
right, one last thing. One last boss fight. You never cease to surprise me, Blue Hedgehog. I thought that capsule you were in exploded in space. You know what can I say? I die hard. So, there's more to you than just looking like me. What are you anyway? What you see is what you get. Just a guy that loves adventure. I'm Sonic the Hedgehog. I see. But you know, I can't let you live. Your adventuring days are coming to an end. Kinda doesn't show the whole conversation on that one. But that's okay, we kinda got the whole conversation last time. Alright. Alright. I think we're, uh... No! Come on! Rolled right through the railing. Sonic Wind! Or I can just jump over it like I just did. Well, we're almost done. Come on! See, that's the problem with having Light Dash be the, the same button as, uh... As Somersault. Listen, he saw Shadow do it once, and he's like, oh, I get it now. You know, it's- it's just that easy. Ah! Okay. There we go. Lost so many rings! Oh, those rings could have gone to the K Chow world. I would have made so much money. It's okay. I'll I'll grind for rings one of these days. I never noticed he did that line. Well done, Faker. I love it. I th although I think we established that I think you're the fake hedgehog around here. Come on. Come on. Ah! Let me hit you. Come on!
There we go. so close. We almost got him. Ugh, come on, no. I know, I know what, I know what you'll do. There we go. We're done. win. <laughs> oh, but what's this? Well, I guess we'll find out next time on the, uh, the last story. But yeah, uh, that that does it for Dark Story. Uh, thank you all so much for coming. I mean, I'm I'm gonna let the. I don't actually know if it'll if it'll. Oh yeah, I can't I can't skip the credits. Uh, but it's fine. Uh, we'll we'll just stick around and then you'll get to see um. You'll get to see the cool promo video they do, for uh. They get to do the cool promo video for Last Story, which is arguably one of the more, uh, one of the more artsy, pretentious parts of Sonic Adventure 2, but yeah, I, I kind of love it. But yeah, I, I think I'm gonna mostly just... I think what I'm gonna do, so that it can be end up being a full uh, stream, is I think I will do... Um, I, I will go and go... I will go get the, uh, the items that I missed, which what I think would be uh, everybody's Mystic Melodies except for Sonic's and Shadow's. Um, Shadow's Fire Ring. Um, Tails and... Tails and Eggman's Hyper Lasers. Uh, Rouge's Treasure Scope. Oh, and Sonic's Magic Hands, which I consistently forget is an item in this game, because 
I honestly have like almost no use for it at all. But it's there, and it is a cute little weird thing you can do. Uh, and then that should be enough to uh, take us up to like uh, to finishing out last story, which is like what an hour tops. It's a stage and two bosses. Oh, now we get to see this cool promo video for Last Story. It's so cool. You can now select scenes from the Dark Story. Hell yes. And boss time attack, time attack boss stages for Dark Story. And new two player battle stages. Level 4 has been unlocked. The ultimate life form. End of chaos Sonic Adventure 2, last episode. Wishes are eternal. God. Like, they put that in a Sonic game. That's crazy. I miss when Sonic could just do that. And, like, go unquestioned. Alright, so I think that's going to uh, call it for this stream. Uh, thank you all so very much for for coming. Uh, thank you uh, for you know, thank you for for having a good cool fun time. A good chill uh, Sunday morning with uh, with more more of our, uh, our sonic fun. Our sonic madness. Uh, we will be back next week to get everybody's items again, and also to get, uh, to see the last episode, uh, which is truly something, and definitely a high point for this game. Um, but yeah, uh, that's gonna do it for now. Uh, you know, uh, if you liked this stream, by all means, uh, tell your friends, uh, you know, I, it's always, it's always good to have, uh, you know, more the merrier, as I always say. Um, you know, you can follow me on Twitter, at Paradox Piper. You can follow me on Tumblr, at ParadoxPersona.tumblr.com. You know, you can find the links to my socials, uh, in my, in my About section, if you want to know where to find me. Um, I think the next stream will probably... I don't know. It'll be either more, uh, either more Xenoblade or more Resident Evil, or maybe something new. I don't know. Uh, but yeah, next Sunday for sure, definitely more uh, Sonic. So yeah, I think that's gonna call it for this, for for this stream. Uh, thank you all so much, and uh, hope you all have a good rest of your days. Bye.